Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Dying Light 2 uh, guide video on how to get back to the city. If you fast traveled away back to the starting zone and you did not unlock any fast travel points back here. Honestly, my heart is still pumping because I thought I was going to have to restart. <laughs> anyway, let's not waste some time and I'll show you how to get there. Alright, well my hands are still shaking, I got this, this is crazy. So, first of all, uh, you will need to put yourself a marker point over here and come to this location. Now do have in mind that if you haven't passed the main storyline here, you're not going to be able to do this uh, to get to the city, right? Because you haven't done the main story. I'm not going to do any spoilers, so have that in mind. So you come back here, you should already notice uh, the tunnel, right? Because you've already been here, you did the storyline, right? You run through, by the way, if you want, you can pick up some old goodies over there as well. So the loot has reset it, you can pick up some stuff if you want to. <laughs> I personally returned back to the starting area because I wanted to discover more. Because uh, I kind of like rushed in with the main story and I wanted to do a little bit more exploring and finding stu new stuff and also make some guides on how to like get some decent loot for honey, for feathers and stuff like that. So that's coming soon. So you'll need to run all the way, all the way through here. I do have in mind, uh, it didn't take me uh, to get there from the first try. So I hope this time we're gonna get it. So you pass this bridge, then you pass that bridge over there. All right. You walk, jump. You do not go down. I've spent 30 or maybe 40 minutes down in that area. And there's nothing there, so do not go down. There's nothing there. Personally, I love to uh, go through this wire just by jumping on it. Although you can just like do a, I'm, like I find it easier just to walk on it. Why, whenever I'm recording, I cannot get it done right. All right, screw this. Okay, just hold on. <laughs> so you gotta get to the other side. The most hard part is coming soon. <laughs> this is all part easy at the moment. So afterwards, you need to get to the other side as well. And right now we are here. Now this is the hardest part. You need to get to that side over there. The only way so far that you can get is by jumping to that thing right there. The only thing that you have to know is that when you're jumping, and I really hope that you have a few skill points in your uh, parkour, which is, uh, where is that thing that allows you to jump when you're, this one right here, allows you to jump a higher distance, right? But that's not going to save you as well. You will need to open your power, uh, not power glider, you know, you'll need to open your, uh, what do you call it? Uh, paraglider, right. I, by the way, I am from Ukraine, so sometimes I mispronounce stuff. Do have that in mind. So you need to jump and open it instantly in order to get to that point. Otherwise, you will fall and yeah. open it instantly. There you go. Then quickly and open it again. And there we go. Afterwards, keep it this way so you don't get affected by the chemicals. Although you will start to get some effect right here but you need to get to that tank and you will be saved so there we go we got to the tank area now you come here and you see that spot over there land that's where you need to go next so what you do is once again you jump you open your thing actually let's try to do it like this yeah don't mind that just go straight there because that's where you have to go <laughs> All right, let's remove it. Once we're here, aim up. Where's that stupid tree? Uh, oh, there it is. So afterwards, you navigate to this tree. What you need to do from here is once again uh, jump as far as as high as you can and make it over there. So if you can jump in the water. Thank God, there's no chemicals in the water, so you're safe. There we go. Uh, actually, you know what? Hold up. Let's save that stamina over there. And let's just get here. I think this is going to be easier. 
jump, open it straight off the bat, and go. Oh, damn it. Well, if you get a chemical thingy, just let it go. And right in the water you go. Swim up. Whew, my still hands shaking, man. It is crazy. Now you swim all the way there. <laughs> Honestly, man, I was live streaming the main storyline, right? This Let's Plays. And decided to go back, and I didn't think of like, and I didn't pay attention that I don't have a fast travel point. I was all panic mode. I had to rewatch my old stream on how to get to that tunnel. <laughs> and I was praying, man, please, please don't do this to me. Like, let me through. <laughs> and then it took me a couple of hours to actually figure all this thing out, get to the dam. Like, this is the dam I have unlocked it. So that's why I'm recording this. So you can follow this to path right here. You jump. You go up. And there we go. We're here. Oh, you can get a bee over here. Sweet. <laughs> Some more goodies. Right. So pretty much, you're already uh, at the spot. Pretty much. What I did is just jump right here. Car glide back. And we're getting to the main city so basically there's the stairs and, and you will get to the first sort of area of the city so if we open our map that's where we're gonna end up being at or you can of course I mean from here you can already decide where you wanna go just don't go into chemical land and stuff like that but pretty much this is uh, how you get back to the city if you uh, <laughs> being a noob like me <laughs> and you fast traveled away without unlocking a, a fast travel point. So I hope you found this video useful and if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you got something to say, feel free to comment. The only thing I ask of you is not to swear. Simple as that. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Once again, thanks all for watching this video, and I will see you on the next one. I'll, I'll try to create a few more guides for this game. I'm really, really enjoying it, and I'm playing as an archer though. So there's a couple of interesting things coming up. And by the way, as of recording this video, if you are not aware, there is a war going on in Ukraine right now. And if you feel like doing any charity or donations, I will have two links to two funds. One for military and the other one for humanitarian, created by the NBU, which is the, the National Bank of Ukraine. So if you're uh, able to help us all out and you're feeling doing, I mean, anything, anything helps uh, feel free to use those links and I'm sure that myself and a lot of Ukrainian people will be very thankful for any support that we get from the entire world that we are already getting by the way so Z Clan and everybody else thanks all for watching I'll see you on the next one bye From the ashes we rose and to the future we'll go We are the clan, we have a gamer's soul By the might of the sword we put the pen to the test We are the clan, we are the gamer's best The clan, the clan Our hearts and our soul we will forever know Our community stronghold, this is our song Yeah.